Direct contact of food proteins with echematous lesions is thought to be the main cause of epicutaneous sensitization. To further investigate the development and pathogenesis of food allergy in vivo, a good mouse model of epicutaneous sensitization is needed. However, a fundamental problem in that regard is that the optimal age for epicutaneous sensitization of mice is unknown. In this study, we attempted to elucidate that optimal age. Methods dorsal skin of wild type bulb, see female mice, 1, 3, 8, and 24 weeks old, was shaved, depilated, and tape stripped. A thin chamber containing a 20 ml aliquot of 20 mg ml, OVA, was applied to the tape stripped skin on three consecutive days, week, for three weeks. The body temperature was measured after intraperitone low the challenge. Serum ova specific hyge titers and ova induced cytokine production by spleen cells were measured by ELISA. Dendritic cells, DCs, that migrated to the draining lymph nodes were quantified by thick labeled ova and flow cytometry. The mRNA expression levels in the dorsal skin were measured by qPCR. Results a significant age dependent body temperature decline was observed after OVA challenge. The serum OVA specific hyge titer, OVA induced cytokine production, that is, IL4, IL5, and IL13, by spleen cells, and number of fit OVA engulfing DCs increased with age. In addition, mRNA for IL33, but not TSLP or IL-25, was significantly induced in the skin by tape stripping and increased with age. Conclusions 24-week-old mice showed the greatest DC migration, Th2 polarization, age production and body temperature decline. Skin-derived IL-33 is likely to play key roles in those changes, 